If you're new to our channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the bell icon. Can you guess which space of the house is known as the heart of the house? Well, it is kitchen. And rightfully so, because this is one such area where we spend time every single day without fail. Be it your morning breakfast, your lunch, or even your midnight snack, this is where you head to. Well, hello everyone. Welcome back to Design Cafe's YouTube channel. I'm Ananya Joyce, your interior architect. And if you're new to our channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the bell icon. Regardless of how well designed your kitchen is, the beauty of it comes from the kind of finish that we go for for your kitchen cabinets. There are multiple options that are available in the market these days. It could be laminate, acrylic, lacquered glass, PU coat and so many more options. But today we're going to be looking at uh, the difference between laminate and acrylic, the two most popular and very similar looking finishes that are available. Well, here we have two swatches of both acrylic and laminate finish. Now, acrylic finish is made of polymers, which is very similar to lacquered finish. Now, laminate is made up of flat papers and plastic resins, which is pressed together in high pressure machinery. Well, here we have a beautifully done acrylic kitchen. Now, acrylic is one of the most sought after finishes in kitchens. Well, this has a finish that is fully glossy and smooth mirror-like appearance, which is also absolutely seamless. Well, acrylic finish comes with a ton of options for colors and bright variants. Well, here we have a combination of white and purple. Well, the colors on this and the gloss do not fade over time and it is retained for the longest of period. Now, the cost of this is slightly more uh, expensive when compared to laminate, but the look and feel of it is absolutely stunning. Well, here we have a laminate kitchen. Laminate is something that has been here in the interior design industry for the longest time. Now, laminates come in varied ranges, colors and textures, unlike acrylic. Here, we also have wooden, stone finish and more. This particular kitchen is a stone finish laminate kitchen. It is looking absolutely striking, like you can see. When it comes to durability, laminates are less prone to scratches and they have a better shelf life uh, when it comes to wear and tear. Well, if you're looking at the cost aspect, laminate is way more cost effective compared to the acrylic finish. Well, here we have a combination of laminate and acrylic in the same kitchen and this is a very trending combination these days. Now, there's a reason why we've used the acrylic for the top cabinets and laminate for the bottom cabinets. Now, acrylic is a glossy finish, so it reflects a lot of light. So it is perfect to go for the higher portion of your kitchen. Now, laminates need to go on the bottom part of our kitchen because this is prone to more wear and tear on a daily basis. And laminates are good to go for this purpose. Now, to keep your acrylic kitchen clean, it's absolutely easy. All you need to do is use some mild soap and a damp cloth and wipe it off but absolutely do not use anything with harsh chemicals or ammonia. This can sort of leave a yellow tinge in the longer run or it can even cause slight scratches on your shutter. Now talking about the maintenance of the laminate finish, if you go for finishes like the one that we see here, which is a Betty rustic laminate, you do not have to worry about scratches because you will hardly see anything. To clean it is also quite easy. All you need to do is wipe it down now and then. Well, in conclusion, both acrylic and laminates are great finishes and they both look wonderful in our kitchen. It just depends on our preference and the kind of look that we want to achieve. Well, do let us know in the comment section below if you are team acrylic or team laminates and what you would want to go for your modular kitchen. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and share some love. Also, if you're looking to get your home interiors done, all you need to do is leave your details in the form that is in the description box below and we'll get back to you with a free design consultation. Until next time, see you all.